Do you have this app on your phone? If you were to only take one thing away from this video, using and understanding this app and what it can do for your business is it. Google My Business is one of the few cheat codes in business. Your business profile is where you can reply to Google reviews, set your location on Google Maps, display your opening hours, and so much more. Google is throwing huge resources into this and has recently started advertising on TV, urging people to leave reviews for local businesses. Mm. Gold is green. Much love. Support local businesses you love with a little help from Google. So let us get into this system, what it is, what it likes, and what it can do for your business. It hasn't been all number one hits for Google. They have tried for years and years to get into social media and have largely failed. What they have done with Google My Business is to take a lot of the best elements of social media and apply them to businesses. Instead of creating personal profiles, they have allowed businesses to build and control their own profile. And it all works in a very similar way to social media, which brings us to what it likes. Like all social media platforms, Google My Business wants to be fed. You have got to feed it content, fresh original content. To ensure it receives this, Google My Business does something that no other platform does. It deletes your post after a period of time. You can't just throw up a load of posts in one burst and then sit back and relax. We all wish it could be possible, but unfortunately, it does not work like this. <laughs> Google My Business is set up in a way that you have to keep feeding it. Google wants new content all the time. If you are a restaurant, you can post your menu every week or month, as well as your daily specials. A builder or home improvement company can share photos and videos of recently completed projects, just like on Facebook and just like on Instagram. The key difference is that nobody goes to Instagram to find a plumber. Sure, the plumber can find you on Facebook, but if your sink is leaking all over the bathroom, you are going to go to Google. Oh, Lastly, what can Google My Business do for your business? This one is easy. The business owners that understand this system and play by Google's rules will be rewarded by being shown to more and more potential customers. That's it. It's that simple. Play ball and promote your business in the way Google wants you to, and you will get customers. Great success. Lastly on Google My Business, let's talk about Google reviews. Do not be afraid of Google reviews. Reviews are a massive ranking factor. Google is just not going to recommend profiles with low scores. And so the process of asking a customer for a Google review should be treated as part of the whole customer experience. When a job, transaction, or order has gone well, and you know the customer is happy, then the single best thing you could ask that customer to do for your business is to leave you a five-star Google review. Don't just ask for a review, ask for a five-star review. Obviously, use discretion on this, and if you have just dealt with the customer from hell, maybe don't ask that guy for a review. Rick, have you ever heard the expression, the customer is always right? But should that customer find their way onto your Google profile and leave you a dreaded one-star review, do not panic. If a customer is that upset that they will take the time to find your profile and leave a bad review, you have to shift your focus to your Google profile and future customers. You are allowed one reply to a Google review, and when you are replying to a one-star review, we strongly recommend that you write it from the point of view that you are talking to everyone else on the internet and not the customer who left the review. Other future customers will be able to read this. Now, if your company did genuinely make a mistake, own it. Everyone makes mistakes. If the customer is an unreasonable keyboard warrior, then you can't really do anything about that. But you can show everyone else that your business did all they could and remained calm, professional, and reasonable. 